All right, so this video is gonna be a quick demonstration on how to break the bee AI and get them away from the hive. As you can see, the bees are just cluttered here while their hive is right there. And what you're able to do is just pick up the hive and take it to ship and the bees will stay here forever. So I'm gonna show you a few different ways to do it, but this place that you're going to do it is gonna be most common. Basically what you're doing is you're grabbing the hive and you're gonna make this fence jump here on top drop the hive and then jump off. So there's a demonstration. What you're doing is aiming for this second beam from the tree. So you have the tree, beam one, beam two. That's basically where you're jumping. You're gonna jump twice. Sometimes three times if you can't get it. You can just keep jumping up. I find it easiest if you jump at the beam, jump again. If you don't make it up, then you jump backwards once. You should be able to get up. So basically, all you're doing is you're going to get your hive in position, pick it up, do your two jumps, or three. You're going to drop it on the fence. As you see, I cannot get hit here, so you can use this to regain stamina. And once you have stamina, you go ahead and jump off. And the bees go right here. They won't aggro you. Now, the important part about this is you need to go from the opposite side of the nest and grab it. You need to stay as far away from the bees as possible when grabbing the hive. So here I'd be able to grab it. If you don't, and you try and grab the hive too close, all you're going to do is re-aggro the bees. As you see, if I get between the bee and the hive, they're going to re-aggro to it. So it's important to get on the opposite side of the hive and grab it without the bees seeing you in a way. So as mentioned, once you have the bee disconnected, you're going to go to the opposite side, stay far away, but just grab the hive, and you're able to take this to ship. The bees, as you can see, no matter what, because their hive isn't in range, they won't attack me unless I basically go inside of them. The only time that these bees will re-aggro is when you bring their own hive close to them. If you bring a separate hive close to them, they won't even care. It has to be their specific hive. Here is another fence that you can do it on. Here I find that hugging the fence as close as you can when running up to it is going to get you on top the fastest. So you just hug, jump, jump. Two jumps there. So hug this left side, jump once. Jump again. You're kind of aiming in between where this sticks out in this pole, so in there, jump again. Use it with the hive. I'm gonna go ahead and grab it. Put it on top. Drag the bees away. As long as I don't get too close to the hive, or too close to the bees and the hive, pick up the hive and drag it away. Here's one last spot with the cabin. I enjoy this one the most. So what you're going to do is for the jump, you're running up this hill, jumping right, and then jumping left. So just running uphill, jump right as far as you can, jump again to get on here, and then you're going to bring the hive up here and drop it on this corner. So here's that demonstration. I'm gonna go ahead and grab this hive. Wonder where we were. Jump to the right. Jump up. Drop the hive here. We need to drop down. Get them away from their hive like usual. As you'll see, they'll go over there. Then just go right back up. pick up the hive. Take it back. That's all I have for this video. I hope you all enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe and join the Discord. We have a great time in there. I'm kiting the bees! I saw him, I don't know.